Alright guys, today we're going to be talking about silver, and in particular, the silver that I have here, which is Scottsdale silver. The ones in the background are Scottsdale silver, what they call the one, and they are one ounce pieces of silver, and they are in a 10 pack is how they sell them. The going rate right now is is $366.64 if you pay with a credit card and the 10 ounce bars are $369.24 and that price as most of you know will fluctuate yeah um, silver has been hovering right around the $30 range give or take right now it is 33 um, just over 33 bucks so why silver and why in particular this type of silver? Well, silver is a great thing to add to your investment portfolio if we're talking, um, you know, to diversify. You want to have silver, you want to have gold, real estate. This all depends on who you're talking to. But in, in my opinion, in the opinion of a lot of people that, um, have a well-rounded knowledge of investments, it's good to have a number of different investments, including stocks, including, uh, it, in theory, it really depends on what your opinion of an investment is. Now, silver, uh, according to most investors and according to um, uh, a lot of people in the know, if you will, uh, say that silver is very undervalued for what it appears to be, that the prices are manipulated. So you might be paying $33 in an ounce, and in all actuality, uh, there's some people that claim that silver is worth more than gold, and the reasoning behind that is, is that gold, um, all the gold that has been found over the years is still here in one form or another. Uh, you know, maybe it's been put gold-plated, this or that, but for the most part, it's in jewelry. So a lot of it isn't consumed, so to speak, as where silver um, is used in various uh, different areas, uh, such as medical supplies and, and electronic communications and all kinds of things. So the actual uh, value of silver is actually a lot lower than what it should be, according to most people. Uh, so it is a good investment. So what, what you'll see is as the amount of silver is either taken up in what we have here, this type of uh, silver bullion, or used up in the different fields, we'll start to see the price gradually increase. As um, Also, as we see the dollar decrease in value, we will see this increase. Now, the beauty of this is owning, say, silver bullion like this, uh, as opposed to owning silver stock, is this is right here. I can touch this, this is physical. As where a stock is a non-physical thing, um, the beauty of the stock is, as soon as the price goes up, if you'd like to sell it, it's very simple. Uh, with this, you could take this to a um, store, there's other retailers. Now, Scottsdale Silver actually will buy the silver back from you uh, probably a little bit lower than uh, the spot price, but don't quote me on that. Um, but they will buy that back, and that's a, a nice thing to see. And this silver in particular, uh, these ones, which are the 10 ounce bars, are uh, compatible with an IRA. So uh, I kind of looked into that a little bit, but basically they will add that in on your IRA, and I think you have to give it to them uh, to your bank and there's some there's some things listed about that on Scottsdale Silver's website but these 10 ounce bars in particular are they have the certification to allow that not so much with these one ounce as far as right now uh, they, they don't allow that but the one ounce are nice because they come in this package as you can see um, and it keeps them looking nice and fresh uh, you don't have to worry about touching them and getting your fingerprints on them and any corrosion occur. And you're probably you know, going to get limited corrosion, but anytime I touch these, I don't really like to have, um, I like to wipe them down after to keep any of the finger oils off of them. 
and they they're really a beautiful piece too you see manufactured by academy on the back and on the front they have a nice lion this one actually got a little bit scratched up these are stackable as you can see um, I like to keep them protected uh, this is yeah 80 ounces here which isn't a whole lot but um, you know it's a nice little size just for demonstration reasons here that you can see how how nicely they lay out and they have you know a nice weight to them like I said 10 ounces and it's it's a lot of um, of weight per how small it, it is it, it just looks like it wouldn't weigh as much as you know it's uh, its appearance um, but the overall looks of this silver in particular is good and with the fact that it is compatible with the IRA like I said that was my main uh, buying point the buying points that I looked for as well as uh, the fact that they're they're one of the most um, they're one of the best looking pieces of silver and on a troy ounce that I was able to find you know 9.99 pure silver made in the USA they have that beautiful lion head on the front I think that it looks phenomenal um, so this is definitely something you want to look at now should you only have silver no I think you should have gold as well um, I think you should have just you know a quick snippet here I think you should have gold as well I think you should have some real estate and you know various other stocks IRAs but this is a nice thing to add in so as far as uh, economic collapse preparedness I myself don't see uh, trading silver because I would want to trade for either goods or services directly and um, I wouldn't see silver as an actual uh, thing to buy with but you could use that for, you know if somebody was able or was willing to accept the silver as uh, a type of currency which has been used for a very long time for currency um, if you want to date back to the you know <laughs> Jesus ages you know silver has been around for a very long time and I don't see it going away anytime soon along with gold but after an economic collapse and during an economic collapse uh, you will be able to retain some type of value you know if your stocks go away uh, you still have your real estate and if you know you still have other forms of currency uh, one of them being maybe silver if you have silver gold uh, different tools around you know that can be traded for other things ammo weapons uh, these types of things that we will see being used instead of paper money which is you know fiat money which will have uh, no apparent worth uh, so you really won't see anybody trading or using that to actually buy goods and services if it has no value uh, it'd just be like playing with monopoly money so I hope this gives a little bit of education and for those of you that are curious with this and I'll just turn around these ones so you can see the back side of these in case you wanted to see that it has kind of a um, interesting design pattern mm -hmm. to it let me just kind of zoom in on that for you so you can see that it's kind of a cool design and like I said on the front has the lion head have it upside down and like I said they're very uh, beautiful pieces of silver bullying in here so hope that educated some of you and uh, sway a purchase in the near future and as always, thank you for watching and leave comments below.